So we finally reach the Bakihama father and son fight. This has been a long time, years in the making, which we wanted to see this fight and they've been teasing it from the very beginning. But is it worth your while? Let's jump in. So first of all, there are a number of episodes that you don't necessarily need to watch. This is one of those classic animes which you kind of want to skip to the fight scenes. And the fight scene in this with the actual father and son fight scene is about six episodes long. There's 26 episodes in total in this season. We get, I think, about 14 episodes. And there's some backstory to some other characters, the training and what has happened to some of the other characters, really kind of wrapping it up. The even part of the series that a lot of people just didn't like. They're talking about some of the characters, what happened to them in there but if you just want to watch the fight scenes then go go towards the end look at the descriptions and you won't have missed that much it also continues to have a lot of narration it leans heavily on the narration to tell us what's happening in the fight rather than let us see what's happening in the fight i was really hoping that they had a lot of budget or were saving budget so that they would show us the big fight scene so there are movements that we see on screen with this animation in their fight scene we will get the sound effects and often we will get a beautiful screenshot of a foot or a leg or a punch and then it will be panned so not a lot of animation just a few frames then we'll get a bunch of narration as to what's happening with their fight scene Then occasionally we'll get some movement again with that classic sound that they do that they've had the whole time in this anime and that is how they showcase the fight so the fight itself seems epic in nature when it's all put together it's cleverly done in a way that you think you've watched a really great anime fight but if you break it down you actually haven't because compared to Jujutsu Kaisen or Demon Slayer or even some of the other boxing anime that we've seen those fight sequences you get to see the camera moves wider the it pans around some of our characters we get to see other movements and leg work and it's not just this oversaturated narration of this characters telling us the history of this movement and why what they felt in that moment this is the classic when when you study film they say show don't tell this is the opposite they're telling most of the time and then showing us with some screenshots and panning left and right and sound effects to kind of cover their style of animation which i kept hoping i kept hoping that they wouldn't do that and every time i come back i'm like no i love anime we're we're gonna keep going with this i don't think that many people hate it as much as i do i don't hate it but i've grown from a place of where i was championing this anime to a place where it's like, oh, they're really going to keep doing this and it's not going to get any better to the moment we've been waiting for going, ah, oh, yeah, this is epic. And it is epic in scale and everything that you kind of want it to be, except it's the same styles. It's more of the same, which I find <laughs> very frustrating. I really need to just go and get the manga and read that. I think fans have been telling me for ages, read the anime. So I think I'm going to do that or go and watch a better anime to console myself. So I'm going to give this two Nicolas Cages out of <laughs> and you've got one. Congratulations. The fight segment of this as a whole. I think some of the stills are incredible. And I like what the characters are able to do. I like the voice work. I like the narration. But it just as, a, as an all-encompassing fighting anime, it just doesn't work at the most core part of it, which it is the fighting, which you need to see, which is disappointing. Let me know your thoughts down below. Maybe you love it and you love the style. That's fine. Each to their own. Thanks so much for watching, but most of all, until next time, remember, live long on Tuesday.